UK automakers had their worst January since 2009. The reason for this is also the consequences of Brexit. Due to the corona pandemic and the consequences of Brexit, car production in Great Britain also once again far sharply fell in January. A little more than 86,000 vehicles meant a 27.3% decrease compared to the same month last year, the Industry Association SMMT announced on Friday in London. It was the worst January since 2009 and the 17th monthly decline in a row. Since the start of the pandemic in March 2020, the industry has suffered losses of 11.3 million pounds. That's 12.97 billion euros. SMMT boss Mike Horse called for further financial aid from the British government. But we have to reopen our Corona safe car dealerships as soon as possible. This is the fastest way to recover the UK automotive industry, says Horse. Several factors, including the ongoing effects of the pandemic, global supply chain problems, prolonged downtime and disruptions in the new trade agreements after the end of the Brexit transition period, had an impact on production, said the Society of Motor Manufacturers and Traders, the SMMT. 80% of the vehicles still go abroad, but sales in almost all important markets fell significantly. In contrast, the share of alternative drives has increased significantly. Every fourth car is battery operated, plug-in hybrids with external charging of the battery and classic hybrids in which the battery or braking force generation supports the combustion engine. And if you want to stay informed, please subscribe to my channel and to my other channels. I'll see you in my next video. Auf Wiedersehen.